Hi, this is Rich Edmonds. In today's segment, I'm going to talk to you about the chip shot. I want to be very clear about the chip shot, and I want to be sure that you understand completely what a chip shot is, okay? So the first thing I want to do is clarify that. A chip shot is a shot that's low and rolls, okay? It comes out low and rolls to the target. Another way to think about it is you're basically trying to chip the ball to the green to get it working like a putt immediately, okay? That's a chip shot. Here's a good way to understand what a chip shot looks like visually because this is what you should do when you're golfing anyway is visualize. So if I'm going to hit a chip shot down to this hole down here, what I would do is visualize throwing the ball. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to toss the ball and try to land it at the very first part of the green and roll it down to the hole. So here I go. You can basically chip the ball with almost any club in the bag, okay? Because you could take a hybrid or a three wood and tap the ball with that and get it rolling right away. Or you can start to use your longer irons, five, six, seven iron. That's gonna make the ball roll a lot. If you use your lofted clubs, as I'm doing here, I have my 60 degree, which some people call a lob wedge, my 60 degree wedge that I'm going to actually hit a chip shot. So let me show you the basic setup for a chip shot. For a chip shot, as we know, we want to land it close to us and have it roll out. So therefore, I'm going to set up with the ball to the back of my stance, so much so that my head is actually in front of the golf ball. Okay, so one of the keys to the setup for a chip shot is ball position back in the stance. The second key is the weight should be primarily on the forward side, on the target side. And the reason for that is that this is an accuracy shot, it's not a power shot, so we don't need to pivot and use weight shift for a chip shot. So therefore, we wanna kinda of stabilize the weight and kinda of sit right on that left leg, okay? So, so far we've said, I've said, ball back in the stance, weight on the forward side. Here's the third thing. We talked about this earlier in the introduction, is we're gonna use the leading edge when we hit a chip shot, okay? So I've got the ball back in my stance, I've got my weight left, and now I'm going to use the leading edge and I'm going to go ahead and hit down into the ground just slightly behind the ball. Now that ball, I think I can do a little better than that. Let me try one more time. So again, to review, I've got the ball back in my stance. If you will, reference your right ear or even your right shoulder. The ball should be back for a chip shot. We want the ball to go low and roll, okay? The second thing is we wanna get the weight kinda on that left side and stabilize it there because we don't want our lower body moving around. And the last thing is understand that you're using the leading edge of the club and don't be afraid of that leading edge brushing right into the grass because that's gonna put the face of the club right on the ball into a nice, chip shot type of a swing. So what I want you to do now is I want you to go check out the other video I have posted on chipping because I've got some visual tools in there to help you better understand how to chip the, chip the ball properly. And I really believe that when you make being a good chipper a priority, your golf game is gonna improve immediately.